ESWL stands for Extracorporeal Shockwave Lithotripsy. It involves the generation and transmission of uh, pulses uh, through the skin focused on the kidney stone which then fragments uh, and the fragments are passed uh, in the urine. Its major advantage is it's a day case procedure under no anaesthetic and um, it is very effective for certain types of stones in certain patient groups. However, it's not effective for all stones and there are some very large stones and very hard stones which are not affected by lithotripsy. In addition, some patients are not suitable for lithotripsy, particularly those with a high body mass, mass index, in which uh, case the, the shock waves uh, are dissipated into the body before reaching the stone uh, and are very much weakened and the stone is not fragmented. The major disadvantage to lithotripsy is that we very rarely are able to um, analyse the stone fragments afterwards because the uh, fragments are passed out in the urine, uh, whereas ureteroscopy and flexible ureteroscopy were able to take a stone fragment and send it off for analysis.